Check number two, yeah. Do you want a okay, bite? Hold on, I got this fish more. Hold on, hold on. I, I don't want the fish want a bite because I. Okay, I'm gonna drink oh. all the time. I don't want the fish are coming because of I'm here. Get him, Roy. In the head. That's the one, baby. That's getting bigger, boys. What is up, man? It's true. Nick Morris here. Welcome to another episode of Real Adventures Hawaii. First time here. Welcome aboard. We're coming back. Welcome back aboard. Today we are fishing the Wild Wild West. The last day Roy Boy's here. He leads them all back to college. We just dropped the lines. We flew it out uh, 18 miles. A couple lures out. It's gonna be a lucky. I know. Oh yeah. Special guest fishing with us today for the first time is the one and only. Damien. Captain Damien. <laughs> So we saw some fish over here, we saw some ashes, so we're gonna run the stick. Wait till we get straight, man. Don't you drink them yet. We're gonna run the stick out. See if we can pull a stick bite. What? Okay. Look at those squids all bouncing, Damien. Hey, you see the squids bouncing? Yeah. Watch, if you watch, you might see how I jump out of the water and eat it. Yeah. Oh, boy, missed it. Oh, missed one? it. He, the two missed it. Oh my gosh, I see oh, it! Go. Oh. Missed it, huh? Oh, Good size ones, huh? Yeah, those are big ones. Just missed it, huh? That's cool! Gone? Oh, 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 oh. You're only getting one at a time. I, I gotta slow down. Oh! Damien, oh. oh. yeah. step here, please, Damien. Damien, I want you up here, please. Yep. Yeah. Alright, go ahead, Rick. Oh. Oh. oh, this is fun fishing okay, now. Ahead. It just became harder. It might be on this one, I think. No way wash, baby. No way wash, baby. How you like that, baby? Alright, grab number four. Yep. So I guess as you saw, that was another stick bite. That was Damien, what do you think about that thing? Was that awesome? Oh, that's not awesome. That's super duper I am amazing. You like that? <laughs> yeah, Damien. Awesome? Yeah, we just got hey, started fishing Damien, now. Damien, remember we said about your first tuna on the boat, right? Yeah. Would have blood stain your boat. Nah, uh, Uncle Roy will get it. I think about 45, huh? Yeah. 40, 40, oh. 45, 40. We just got thrown fishing now, boys. <laughs> <laughs> now we got we're starting fishing now. David, yeah. your first fishing trip, what do you think? Pretty good? Good. Put I them, love it. Put them on the meat. Right, that's all. Put them on the meat. Yeah. Oh, right there. We're on, on. on. Oh, I missed it. We're on, David. What can I yeah. do to help? You surfing, you can watch. This is too dangerous. Oh, this is a good size one, I think, yeah? Set number two, yeah? Do you want a okay, bite? Hold on, I got this fish more. Hold on, hold on. I, I don't want the fish want a bite because I... Okay, I'm going to drink oh. all this up. No, no, don't worry, don't worry. There, now you do them. Don't worry. I don't want the fish are coming because of I'm here. Get him, Roy. In the head. That's the one, baby! That's bigger, boys! <laughs> David, David, what's better than one fish? Two fish! Alright, so we got two in the boat, two in the meat. So we're going again. What's up, David? Don't, don't gaff anybody. Don't put it like that. You're gonna gaff somebody. I try not to. Oh, we're just gonna get some fish. David, is that badass? Yep. How badass is that, David? <laughs> David, what do you think? I like fishing on the green machine. Good. Earlier it was boring. Now it just got fun. That was 
Goku watching a go man of Royal Boy battle. <laughs> The splash behind is the is the bird. The okay. splash the splash in the very back is our stuff in it. Okay. That's nothing. I'm coming down there with you guys. Okay. Why is it all freaking guys? Whoa, that's big guys. I'm gonna yeah, Gillen got him. Did you Gillen got the smaller one? Yep. Awesome. Daddy, that's you should hit them in the gill so it kills them. You wanna bet the next one they mean? Yeah. You should do you should get your grundons on. Swing out blood all over you. I don't care, I tasted blood before. Yeah. Daddy! Yes, Steven. Teamwork makes the dream work. Oh, you know that, buddy. So Uncle Matt, Uncle Matt brings the fish to us, boy boy gaps it, and I bet it. Oh my god! Oh, shrimp. Oh, I'm heavy. Oh, there you go. Miss. Miss. Oh my god. <laughs> That's number three, huh? Number two. Number two. Oh, number three. That was number three, miss. This is where the big ones are right here. Oh, hang on. Number, the front I got my bat ready. That's three, how we miss? Yeah. Oh, the water boil. Oh, five. Five. Oh, there we go. There we go. On, 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 on. Okay. I'm going to slow down, yeah? Yeah, go ahead. Let's do this. Let me come up here, please. Or you just sit on there, even. Yeah, I'm gonna whack it with the back in the gill. What's the weak point? Where are you, boy? Where should I whack it at? Right in the head. Okay. I got my bat ready, guys. Number two, yeah. And maybe all the way up, yeah? Good size. Okay, see you guys right now. See all you guys. Oh! Yeah, you. Bam, hey, don't hit my boat! Damien. Yeah, hit him! Hey, Damien, you did. He's not done yet! 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 He's not done Damien, it's not the only thing. It's good, Damien. It's good. Bro, we got three tuna. Muscle fat. Damien, I hold him on each other. I'm going to make it. I should start icing it. Yeah, yeah. We can put them on each other, right? I want to go back. Oh, he's on the left side, huh, Roy? Yeah. So, Captain Damien on the fly bridge. Don't be turning the wheel too much, guys. So, we're going to run some lures. We're going to pass some lures. Right there, perfect, Damien, perfect. So we're on a hundred percenter, uh, ice blue jet. This is one Damien made the other day. Looks pretty good. He picked the, right, bit, he picked the script colors and everything. That's I good. think it's a scoop. Uh, strawberry jet. We're on this. I want to put that your lure on this one, Damien. Where? On this corner. Yeah. So any good fishing trip, you always have to feed the sea guys. You gotta get something, you have to give something. So we have Captain Damien that's gonna deploy the moose to be. Can you hold on to the plastic? Don't pull the plastic in, Damien. Yeah, I know. Yeah, you. Good job, buddy. We're working on a bird pile right now. What did you see? You saw Akus? Can I tell you something? What? Every time you subscribe, Damien will be in more of my my dad. Videos. Oh really? Yeah. So the more you subscribe, the more videos will be in. Yeah. Oh boy. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. He was lucky today, I'll tell you that much. First trip with the adventure crew. He was game, I'll tell you what, you about the good luck today. Yeah, three sheep, you first see the more, you can't complain, right? Like 50, 60, 70 pounders. But guys right now, market price is super high. Like $8 a pound, $7 a pound, something? so. Let's spend the money right there. We're already fishing the green. That's always a good trip. Fish are free. We're gonna eat like champions. Too bad Roy Boy leaves tomorrow. Right, hey, let's come back summertime. Come back summertime and kill that fish. Right, Roy, coming back summer to kill the fish. Right, Roy. Yep. Man, I'm gonna turn back first. Yep. Damien, so what? You gonna fish the summer bite with us? Catch some ahe? Ah, you stoked? So what's your job on the boat and catch fish? Batting it. Oh, champion grand slam. 
So, so this is it. Everyone is all. I don't think we should call you Captain Damien. I don't think that should be your nickname. <laughs> I don't think we should call you Damien. I think we need to take a better, better name because you're a little bat boy. Captain Batty Damien. No, no. There's only one Captain Boy. I'm the captain. No. I think we have to take a better name for you, like Grand Slam. Hey, Grand Slam. Nah. Hey, home run. No. Home run, a hey, home run. Home run, Damien. Oh, he switched. Swing, bad, bad, swing. <laughs> what are you? Okay, let's go back to this bird ball. Right in front of us, it's gonna pop. Hey, we can't call him Captain Damien. We need a better name, like Home Run Damien or something. Uh, home run. Home run, Damien. Damien, baby Ruth. <laughs> baby Ruth. That's what he said, baby Ruth. Baby Ruth. Went through a burp, I got a single, and Demon all day was like, I want a Marlin, I want a Marlin. I was like, when things raining, that might be a Marlin right there, Demon. Get this guy to the boat, it's coming pretty fast. Fish with Uncle Elliot's reels today. He's electric reels, straight animal style. Is there a small Marlin or a big Marlin? The idea of the small Marlin. Demon, Demon, come up here. I don't want you down there. Demon, come up here, please. I don't want you to put the bat underneath for now. Put the bat when it comes up, you can bat it. Put the bat underneath. No. Come on, Babe Ruth, come up here, Babe Ruth. Hurry up. Put the bat underneath for now. Not there, it's gonna roll behind Uncle Roy. Put it on the gunnel. Right, that's this kid's name, Baby Ruth. So the thing went down, he grabbed the bat. Is that ready to go? Come on, Baby Ruth, sit down. Yeah. I want you up here. It's dangerous down there with the Marlins, okay? With the Marlins? Yeah, it's the Marlins. Can I hit it? Yeah, we got the book, hit it. Demi, sit on the chair for now so you want to come up. Yeah, you can bat it. Just wait, Demi. No, no, heavy. Heavy? Heavy. Heavy. Nice one. What is it? It's a heavy. Get rid of bat it, Demi. Is it a marlin? Nice one. Small marlin. Go ahead, Demi. Go ahead, Demi. I want to get cracks on it, right? Go ahead, Baby Ruth, get on the bat. Alright, Baby Ruth. Get on the bat. Here you go, Baby Ruth. Get one in. Go ahead, Baby Ruth. Oh, boy. Okay, I don't want you to hit my deck. Okay, don't hit the meat. Okay, good. Good job, Baby Ruth. Good job, buddy. That's it, there's Marlin. Good job, Damien. Woo! Alright, that's a Alright, so. Not too bad. We got a nice heavy. Wait, that's a Short Bill Marley, yeah. Nice heavy. This kid is trying to run down for the fire. I need a baddie. I need a baddie. Need a baddie. It's a Marley. You need to you need to slow down a little bit. You're a little dangerous. Yeah, you. Why well, man? I'm gonna get the deck all cleaned up. They're gonna put the heavy away. It's a short, a short bill Marlin. Like a what's that? Like a short bill Marlin or a spearfish or something? Yeah, short bill spearfish. Short bill spearfish. Yeah, yeah excellent eating. Yeah. Unbelievable eating. That's actually a really good size one. David's having epic chips so far. Lots of firsts for him. Lots of firsts today. First time he threw up on the boat, that was today also, that was the first. <laughs> if you're new here, we post new videos every Thursday at 9 a.m. Hawaii time. Epic adventures always. Good job, buddy. Can I tell you something? Good job. Every time you like and subscribe, Damien will come. Oh, really? Yeah. Damien will be on more videos. I guess you heard it from the man himself. Stay tuned to find out. All right. You need more fish? Yeah. Let's go. It's 2.50. Oh, it's 22 miles to go. Three bird piles, no love. The short bill heavy or marlin. Short bill marlin is the last thing that a spear fish. What's up, Mark? Comes in our bird pile and we got a few packs of the sticks in here. Something. Nothing over here. We're going to head in already. There's uh, some way, uh, I guess baby root. He made himself tired from using the bat so much today. Too much bad action from Baby Ruth. He's a little tired, so. Check it past these birds with the sticks. Let me get some action. See you guys back very soon. That's right. Give him the bird. Give him the bird. Send the bird. All right, now we're working. Now we're working. All right, boys, we're going to see what happens. The late bite happens. It's starting to look fishy. We've seen some nice tunas and eyes blowing up around the boat. There's other guys over here trolling, but we're right in the stick. You know what I mean, 
And the reason you're riding a stick is to be different than everybody else. Everybody else is riding lures. Let's be different, set ourselves apart, see if it works. I don't see nobody lures picking up. We're not picking up right now. And it goes literally just to be different. So we got Matt doing the jerky, jerky, jerky back there. We got the road boy supervising, taking his uh, union break in the shade. <laughs> and uh, we're gonna see if we get lucky one more time, boys. And girls, and girls. But that late bite, never give up, right? Today's Sunday though. Dave has to go to school and ask to work tomorrow, so. Can't go super late, but if your bites, it's gonna be super late. <laughs> see you guys soon, see you guys soon. One hour later. We on, we all went on, boys and girls. That was the pass. Number three. Yeah, I did number three. Good size, what up? Yep. The pass. The pass, boys. And no freak you. That was funny too, because I lost my talent. <laughs> You're like, oh, oh, and then, you know what I got? Damien. Damien. Batters up. Damien, batters up, Damien. Damien, batters up. Batter up. We're on. Yep. You got all the stuff. The size one. Yep. Yeah. 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 Ye
have a pretty good trip. Hopefully, the prices are high today. Should be able to appear for a few nights. Temp wise, are all good, all below 39 degrees, which is fine. Sorry, Chris, I'm gonna help you, Chris. So, you guys wanna hear a funny one with this guy? His dad's boat name is No Leaky 2. There's No Leaky 1, Leaky 2 much. Yeah? Yeah, yeah, there you go. <laughs> so, so, Chris caught this on the way, your jet ski, right, Chris? Jet ski! Jet ski killer right here. How much more did you catch last week on your jet ski? Last week? Five? Four. Four? Four more on jet ski last weekend. Oh yeah. Oh. That's how you hurt your back. <laughs> well, let's see, that's it, huh? You want more? Oh, you got one yesterday, one day before. I got two over here. There's two marlins. Long line boat just dropped off their load. They said 51,000 pounds total weight today for a fish. Nice thing, guys, all the guys got. But 51,000 pounds today, so. Price should be good today. I guess I'll see you guys back here for the how much we made or pick up our check. Back here, United Fishing Agency at the auction. Let's get our check and see how we did on those those chibis and that small heavy marlin. So overall, I would say we had a pretty good day. Honestly, I think we're just really lucky that all these uh, yellowfin are around, all these chibis are around because they're really helping us to get the reps in on the stick. You know what I mean? If they weren't around, and I could just imagine nine fish on a practice of the stick would still totally be behind the ball right now. I don't think it's dialed in yet. I know we miss a lot, and I think they say you shouldn't be missing that much. So overall, not bad. We got some fish, we made some money. Uh, but I had a slight setback this week when I was coming home. I literally got right around the corner from my house and I blew up my bearings. So that put me back $600, but I'm not adding that into our total, you know what I mean? I'm just kind of fishing money. So it was a rough week, it was a rough week. That sucked took two days to fix because I had to change my spindle and everything so good times you guys always see the good the fun of owning a boat you know what I mean you guys never see a junk cart on the way home from the last trip I blew a bearing right around the corner by my house so I have to replace this one and I have to take them all off to double check everything to be on the safe side but this is a mess that right there is a part of the bearing right there so get the tire off and uh, this is what I'm dealing with. This thing should be tight, okay? That's not good. And honestly, I gotta go through all th other three just to be on the safe side. You don't wanna be, yeah, any boat, I don't care how expensive your boat is, you don't wanna be tempting feet on the freeway, you know what I mean? This is a heavy boat, so. But the good thing is, I don't have to replace the whole axle on these. I can just replace this unit right here, which I'm pretty sure I'm gonna have to do. Because if you look at this, it's all grooved and that's not good at all. If I put a brand new hub on there, it's just gonna eat it up again. It's kind of a heavy duty overbuilt trailer, which is a good thing. So these hubs are very overbuilt and very strong. The bad thing is they're anything that's very overbuilt and over strong, which is a good thing. It always costs more, so it's gonna be an expensive day today. It's a very expensive day today. It'll probably eat up all our fish profit. We say, no, we're, oh, we got fish profit. Honestly, that fish profit means nothing because we still have to do regular maintenance on the boat with oil changes and everything else. That runs me about $200 every time I do it, which is every hundred hours. And with this kind of issue, that should be about a thousand dollars minimum. All right, let's get it fixed. I was here for two hours, pounding out the old one. This is the old one, all rusted on the inside. Two hours underneath there, on the ground, on my hands and knees, pounding this thing out, my neighbor helping me as I pounded it out, telling me which side to pound. And I greased it, put this one back on, Tell you what, only a boat they said be fun. This part right here cost me $120. A brand new axle is 1200 bucks, And you have to put these on the brand new axle. I think the brand new axle would be a lot easier, just two bolts. But honestly, the amount of work it would take to get this thing off how hard it was, if another one of those goes bad, I don't think I can get it off. If I wait like another year, the way it's all rusted in there, it comes together as one piece. I think you literally have to just, honestly, you probably change your axle. I don't know how the hell you get that thing off after another year, but it's on there. Just gotta tighten it up now. Good times. Like they say, only a boat's tons of fun, right? You guys see the good, you guys do not see too much of the bad. But fish wise, for the fish, we did pretty good overall. We had the four sheepies we dropped off and the small heavy that we dropped off. And one other thing I wanna say, 
Thank you to High Fish Gear. I get all my fishing gear from them. Uh, information and links are in the bio for them. If you use a raw five code, you get 5% off. Check them out, support local. Um, and for anybody that buys fish in Hawaii, I mean, even from the mainland, if you buy fish from the mainland, support local, buy from your local fishermen. Do not buy import, you know what I mean? Do not buy import, buy local, keep the money in house. Uh, that's my message to everybody. But the four shibis, the biggest was 62 pounds. We had a 47 pound, a 49 pound, and a 37 pound. And those are all gilling gut weights. And then the owl, the heavy, the, the short bill marlin, was 27 pounds. For the owl, we got five dollars a pound. So that fish came out to 135 dollars. For the shibis, we got between 860 and 810. The prices were smoking, locked out. The prices were super, super high. Normally, it's not the highest, so we did super good on those. $1,644 for the Shibis. You add that with the price for the, the heavy or the short bill Marlin. After auction took their cut, $1,601 is what we made. We minus off our expenses. $300 pretty much for fuel and ice. Um, so I get to $1,301. And like I said, that doesn't take account to wear and tear, like how I blow out the bearings on the trailer and the spindle and that headache I want to just forget right now. Uh, but we're at 13 to our rolling total and we have a new rolling total and like I said this is for the whole year this is for 2021 fishing that's not a ton of money I mean if you're doing it full-time like we're not for doing full-time it's just for fun but support local support your local fishermen do not buy import stuff I mean I'm sure the local fishermen like it uh, but I guess that's it epic time Damien had a super epic trip he's down to go again but overall super epic trip we made some money we had fun I mean good laughs I still Damien got to come Damien was he was stoked all day about it. He, he was talking about like the next two days when we got home. So I kept talking about, oh, I can't wait to go again. I can't wait to go again. But uh, I guess that's it. I guess I'll see you guys next week. I don't know what's going on next week. We didn't film nothing yet. But uh, as always, guys, tight lines, see if you'll see on the water, under the water. And uh, thanks as always. And uh, Roy Boy, go back and study. He flew back just for a couple days just for that. So pretty epic. But Roy Boy, go back and study. All right, everybody. I'll see you guys next week. He's gonna piss his kids right in the wind.